What's going on everybody? This is Fry. So today I'm really excited to show you this wacky wacky deck. We are calling it Lower Your Plants because the entire theme of the deck is to lower the attack of the opposing zombies and then finish them off in a multitude of ways. So the ways that you're going to be lowering their attack is with Bog. Uh, even the uh, Colonel Bolt does lower its attack and health. You also have four copies of Sap Fling, which creates a, sort of like a Mega Bog that's minus three attack. And then you're able to start utilizing really efficient cards like Whack a Zombie. This is a hard removal for anything with three or less. So if it's in a Bog, it's almost for sure going to die to Whack a Zombie. Same thing with Shrinking Violet. Not only, again, these are actually very, we're actually running like very good cards. Let's say the only not good card in this deck is Sap Fling, but I think it could be useful. And uh, Shrinking Violet is going to, you know, lower not only lowers the attack of plants, so it has that setup synergy, but it also has the finisher synergy of uh, reduce, you know, it'll actually destroy anything that, um, that have zero attack at the end of the day. We got a little bit of heal, so this is basically a control deck. I'm going to consider the main win condition of controlling, you know, really just reducing your opponent's attack. It ends up giving you, like, a lot of block meter charge if they're just attacking you with, like, you know, a three attack is pretty significant. One attack is useless and just gives you control powers with everything from freeze to go to five, mog, so you just end up with plenty of removal uh, with the strategy. So, again, the main win condition is going to be dragon fruit. Uh, you can, toadstool is also synergetic because, again, four attack or less, this will also help you ramp to dragon. The reason I'm running Sunny or Shroom instead of running Twin Sunflower, which is a similar card at two cost, is because we're not really running anything that costs five. We do have a lot of sixes in this deck because of the theme of the deck. Uh, so playing this on turn three, again, three health. The three health really is significant if you've seen any of the ramp package videos. You can look those up if you haven't seen those in the past. Sunny or Shroom is actually a much better card than I used to give it credit for because three health is very hard to do three you know you need like a lightning bolt you need like a really strong card as opposed to two health is very easy everything from beam me up summoning usually kills two health so it's a little bit of a meteor card uh, both of these team ups are going to be the cards that you can use for hard removal with the cop cannon cop cannon also does lower the attack uh, so it does fit into the theme of the stack let's see how this wacky wacky deck does we're going to be healing with catch and mechanic i hope there's enough wind conditions i think between the cop cannons and the dragons and the Toads. I mean, we have some power in the deck, so I think it's going to be enough win conditions, but we're really mostly going to be winning the game with Dragons. We need that one really solid late-game card. After we're doing all this controlling, and I'll be able to finish off some opponents. So, 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 my friends, uh, if you think this, these, these games are going to go super slow, this is going to be a long stream. Uh, let's do eight games. So if you think we're going to win six out of eight, vote yes. Five out of eight is going to be an over here at the live stream, twitch.tv forward slash... Prime up. Oh my gosh, these games are going to take so long. Okay, okay. I guess we'll get rid of the late game. I think this is good. We got some heals. We got two removal cards. Then we have some anti-teacher because it's Rust Ball. Very common teacher. What is this? Fry Willy. Stop with the chick babies. <laughs> be a way for me to tell the voice, the text-to-speech. Not, not to spam the same thing 80 times in a row, because between Frimily and Bookist, because they're so annoying. Sweetie Arcade, welcome to the new the new people. Welcome to the old people. Joining us over here in the stream. This is gonna this is gonna be fun. I don't actually know if this is gonna work. So we have two options here. Probably going for a leap play, so removing this should pay dividends. The problem with having the Colonel Pult on the field. It's just going to be pinging block meter and stuff. I'm almost tempted to use hammer. Just so we're not pinging and we'll save this for later. I'm going to just use hammer. This is also more versatile if he plays teacher plus something. We can use this in conjunction with one of our other cards. It's supposed to hammer. That's basically going to be its own turn. Gray zucchini. Because it lowers their attack to one. <laughs> You know what? I'll tell you guys this. How about this? If there's not enough win conditions and the deck doesn't have enough power, I'll scrape off some of the fuzz. I'll reduce some things to some three costs and I'll add a couple great zucchinis. What do you say to that? So again, we have a, more plays now. Um, I think I'm gonna do it like I'm not even gonna shrinking yet. I'm gonna util I'm gonna go for the heels. I'll put a three three on the board. He's still going for leaps. Watch him. Maybe I should have shrinking because he could leap this one. Oh yeah, I should have shrinking violet. I messed up. 
The leap lane one. No, he's going viral. Bruh. Anyway. Not a very impactful play. He doesn't actually have leap. He only had leap station, so that's good. Or else he would have leaped. I don't think you're going viral here. Maybe he's going to leap next turn. So now what? We can swallow this next turn. Don't really have much to do here. I think I'll freeze. For a car. Cobb Cannon. Uh, should I try to take this out? Out? We really have two cards that kill this next turn, including Cobb. He could maybe do a Shrinking Violet. This will be a 2-2, so it actually plays around... I'll, I'll just do this now. He's not spamming a lot of minions. This will be a 2-2. It plays around going viral. It'll kill it even if he does, like, you know, a zombie plus a going viral. That's fine. We have no anti-grave in this deck, but... You can't play around everything, you know? So the frog looks really good here. Uh, oh gosh, game mechanics. No, I forget how this works. Guys, does the frog that will only destroy zombies here with four or less... Does it kill the stealthy imp? It's so rare to see this interaction. Because when you play the the frog, then it gets reduced back to two attack as the anti-hero goes away. Now, I think when they made the game it didn't work, but they changed it at some point and it does. And I have to know this in order to play this deck, so here goes nothing. Does it work, guys? Yes! Yes! Got it! Easy! <laughs> He'll excuse my, my long amount of time it took to make that play because I was thinking, yes, okay. I'm pretty sure in 2016 that did not work. And one of the patches, they changed around some game mechanics. They changed the block meter. For some reason, I think they changed that. And I keep on mixing it up because they used to... Oh my gosh, this guy's down to one health? He rocketed my frog. So we got, we got shrinking here. We got... Oh, what else do we do? We should probably take this out. So I'm just going to Shrinking Violet. We might as well just we bow also. Why not? We and we got the dragon coming on up. Yes. Thank you to Sweetie Arcade for gifting five subs. Thank you so much. Such generosity. Yes. Oh, look at the dragon. Look at the... Look at the stuff happening here. So, I think I'll just drag in like this. I'll just drag in like that. It does a proc the block. Uh, it could get chopped. It's not the end of the world. No! <laughs> well. This turns into a skunk punk or something. Yeah, it gives him a card, actually. <laughs> That's one of the better things he could get with being literally low in cards. Don't get chopped. Da -da 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 -da. Get like uh, your super, your ultimate. Okay, well, it has seven health now. <laughs> Bro, who cares? <laughs> I guess he figures he can't even rot. It'll die for free anyway next turn, though. No. Yeah, this didn't do anything unless he can remove those dragon. Okay, nice. Oh, we got plays. We got play. Oh, we got so many plays. It's gonna be like this. I'll kill you. Open up that lane. Oh, him with another, another dragon, that's gonna finish him off. So, looks like enough win conditions. Yes! When will Tearless come back? Yeah, I don't know, at some point. I should write it down in my deck idea so I see it before I start streaming and be like, oh. I really should, I should continue with the tier list, so maybe I'll do another one tomorrow. <sighs> Tearless. I kind of just enjoy playing PvZ Heroes, though. So we're 1-0. So far, so good. You guys want to see some great Jukini? L let me take a quick peek under the hood here and see if there's any way we can squeeze, like, two great Zucchinis into this deck. Because, technically, it's a great excuse to run it. We need a little bit extra, like, mega late game anyway, after this crazy control deck. Like, what if I just got rid of... There's there's a lot of overkill. Like, I could run this as a three of, because it's the worst card in the deck. Then I can probably kill, like, one card here. I don't want to get rid of anything early. So maybe either, like, one hammer or one shrinking violet or something. 
it, it, it's so overkill to be running four frogs and then four hammers and four shrinking violets. It's super mega overkill. Bad Moon Rising tier list. Yeah, I should do that. I should ta da da da. Wait, so what do I take out? Just take out two of these. <laughs> I want to see this, though. Honestly, this is kind of the whole point of running the deck. We'll keep that as a three of. I'll I'll, I'll do... Is Shrinking Violet overkill? Shrinking Violet's like the best card in this deck. But Okay, we have a lot of three, so I'm going to kill one hammer. This is sort of our alternate turn three control play. And you always have Shrinking Violets, which is kind of like... Mega Hammer in this deck. It's kind of just a hammer that has three lanes. All right. Go! No, I don't want to take out dragons to put in the Grey Zucchinis, because the deck really... It does need a little bit more on the win condition side, in terms of big, late game, heavily impactful cards. Plus, after Grey Zucchini, you can like Grey Zucchini Shrinking Violet. It's great. Great excuse to run the Great Zucchini. Or the Great Zucchini. See, like, in this hand, I almost just want to keep dragons, so we end up with a win condition. I know this being in our hand for... Well, now that we have the Great Zucchinis, I actually don't even have to. So now we have Ramp. Should I look for something to Ramp to? You know what? There's so many sixes. I'm just going to keep double. These are good cards against HG. Very often runs wide boards with the Conjure and the Imps and all that stuff. Uh, I'm not going to use the Chrono Pulch quite yet. It's just giving us Block Meter, not doing too much damage. We have this for the Toxic. What is he going to do on turn two? Probably nothing. Crafting tier list. Uh, that would... I, that probably would work less as a tier list and more as a top ten cards you should craft. I did that a long time ago, but I think I should probably redo that. What is this? He's going for garbage? Bro. Get out of here. <laughs> okay, we have the little one one, but it's fine. He's probably going to teleport another imp into that same environment again. Yep. That's definitely happening, isn't it? Bro, stop teleporting stuff. Oh my god, that's what he got. Great. He got the four damage to face. He got the zero damage to face. Hey, Transmogrify technically lowers the attack of guys into shrinking. I think this is... I think this is a good plan. So we have Weed Whack... I'm just going to hit him with this, and I think because of the heals coming up, this overall is going to help us. I'm, I'm going to hold on to the Weed Whack and spend it. Ooh, look at the Shrinking Violet. It looks delicious. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Well, probably just Shrinking Violet and then Weed Whack this one. Shrinking in three, Weed Whack in five. That looks pretty damn good. He's going to pass here. Should I go for these, though? I can't Shrinking Violet, then. I could, like, go 3-1-1. One, one. I kind of like the heals here instead of just clearing his board. <clears throat> um, I know this is weird, but the Shrinking Violet's always going to be good later. Let's do this. <laughs> Arm Wrestler is fine. We'll hit him with the heals. And then we'll hit him with this. And we have the Shrinking for later. I just really wanted to utilize the three minions on the board to get extra heals. And this is a 4-4. Four, four. That's, that's some good stats right there. This probably should have been in a different light. I could have put this here, actually. I probably should have played this in the bog. <laughs> Too greedy. Such greed. If we roll a 1, it's worth it. Went for Thinking Cap. See what he got. Smash. Okay. <laughs> so much for my 4-4 four, four stats. Oh, look. 4-4 four, four stats. So good. No. No, they're not. Hey, I'll tell you a cute thing. If we had put it in the bog, this would actually have three attack. It would have been down to zero when fronted, and then when you remove the card, it just gets anti-hero three. It's kind of cool. Okay. We're going to have to Shrinking Violet at some point here. Bro! 
Okay. Well, it's just this. <laughs> Good shrinking. <laughs> Everything just melts. Love it. Teleports. Uh -oh. I feel like there's a trickster coming. Oh my god. Okay, well, we lose. <laughs> so much for that. Uh, we'll, we'll block here. We have heals. I don't know. This bog doesn't do anything for us. He rolled one, three. Can we not, not lose just this turn? Uh, uh, we'll lose next turn. He rolled a one, so we're probably dead. God damn! I always forget this game, but because of your videos, I always come back to this game after some time. Thank I just you. wanted to give you a little something back for all the Really appreciate the donation and welcome back to PvZ Heroes. I don't know, there's something about this game. I'm the kind of person who gets burnt out of things and games very easily. There is something about PvZ Heroes that's just made me keep coming back. I hear you, bro. I hear you. Fam. Fam? We'll go with fam. Ugh. <laughs> Skill issue, fraud. Shut up, warm shirt. You're always so negative. You don't need that stuff in here. Get that weak stuff out of here. I should probably run more heals, though, right? I feel like we should be pretty good against the impact. We are really weak to teleport, though. You know, we're not running Brainana. Honestly, Brainana, how much of it really helped us that turn? Well, we would have survived. We need to get Brainana. It's, it's very important. I think I'm just gonna tank the four. Uh, I'm not gonna use Mog on a one drop. Doesn't make sense. Yeah, Cowboy OP. You should play a game called Stormbound. I used to love that game. Uh, it is a mobile, uh, you know, kind of like a card strategy game. Kind of like PvZ Heroes. It has lanes. And the reason why I stopped playing that game is because the cards are upgradable. In terms of their power. I feel like any game... Whether it be Stormbound or Clash Royale, any game that has cards that are upgradable is just automatically pay to win. You can't even make a deck out of the right cards because then you just have one guy who just upgraded their cards one more time than you. And if you beat enough opponents, now you're just facing that dude. And uh, I probably should have played this though, right? It would have died for free, so good thing I didn't. Good thing I'm distracted by Stormbound Clash Royale rants. Uh, he could have a bungee plumber, but this is pretty safe. You think he has trapper territory? You know what? If he has trapper territory... I mean, good for you. We'll probably block and get freeze or weed whacker. And he has bungee. Well, we can still get a superpower on the block here. <laughs> this one doesn't help. God, come on! <laughs> Any other Should superpower would have been perfect there. No sniping, and it says sniper, no sniping. Sniper, no sniping, maybe. Okay, so we'll give him another bog. Oh, that was stupid. I should have hammered this first, but I'm not smart. <laughs> I'm gonna lose just to misplays here. PvZ Heroes is very pay to win. I don't know. I feel like once you have your card, though, there's nothing. You have the card already. Uh, I mean, PvZ Heroes are pretty pay to win. I'm not gonna lie, but come on. Upgrading cards? That's just kind of BS. It's my opinion. What am I gonna do about this? Well, I have to go to fire, right? I wish there was a better play, but I literally can't. So we go. <laughs> This is the problem with these six drops, they're breaking hard. I've been breaking hard. So no more counting dollars. Your mom is made of lard. Woo! I don't know, I don't mind taking one. We, we need like some catching mechanics, desperately. <laughs> oh, here we go, that's what we need. That is what we need, right there, right there, right there. That is what we need. So now, what do we actually destroy? <laughs> I don't know. I'm going on. Soon no more counting dollars. 
We'll be, we'll be. Is this a stupid play? Such a dumb play. We yay, fun. You <laughs> can kill me using cop can and kill little one attack guys. But I guess that's how it's gonna go with this thing. No, bad, bad, <laughs> very bad. That's two more damage, it's okay. <laughs> guys, the teleports are killing us. The teleports are the reason why. Are the reason why. That only does one it why not do three to our face? He just missed lethal. He just threw lethal. Why not go for three attack, bro? Oh look, he does so oh, he splash damage. Oh he's got shu oh now we got heals. He got shurikens and stuff going on instead of winning the game. Come on, man. Give this guy a trickster. Oh <laughs> who cares? The question is who cares? <laughs> So we got three and nothing, actually. All right, we'll give him one of these. Oh, uh, uh, three and four. Yeah, looks good to me. <laughs> looks good to me. I think we'll like clog this lane. I kind of want him to play more into these lanes. There's some heals. Watch, he's gonna lose now. He's like legit, like literally gonna lose the game. He's gonna teleport into something here that just win. Was it BM? <laughs> They've got shurikens and stuff. That should probably go in the fail count. We need some fails. I haven't had enough fails lately. Did he quit too? Did he literally just quit? No, okay. Ah. He feeds me a card though. Come on, heals. Oh, okay. Uh, he's a hungry, hungry hippo. That's nice. I think just dragon. Dragon is like. Dragon is the killer here. We can also go Great Zucchini. It's also not bad. I don't really want this guy playing tricks right now. Should I Mog this turn? I'm gonna save the Mog. I think it's just Dragon. Right. The Mog will be our emergency removal. We have Great Zucchini and Cobb Cannon though. So. Uh, he has an environment. Who cares? It's the opposite, it's the anti-bog. This gives zombies extra two attack. This is the counter to our deck guy. I think we're gonna be good to go, because he can't play tricks, and we can counter any minions with the Great Zucchini. The one-two punch combo. In your face! Bro! Is there a way to actually get lethal here, though? Bro! <laughs> is there, like, six plus four? I'm not seeing it. The Great Zucchini is pretty strong. Oh no, that's like this. It's like this. No, it only does nine. Ah! Three. This is will be five. Wait. Six. And four. Wait. Wait. Mega Brain. Six and four. Yes, there's lethal here. It's a puzzle party, guys. <laughs> it doesn't look like a great play, but this is this is lethal. He has to California roll. We'll give him that. If he cal if he rolls double threes here, oh, are we in trouble? Yes, yes, go easy. Yes, yes, <laughs> yes. Oh, happy day for all the Jews, guys. This deck is so much fun. <laughs> I I know it's really not optimized because we're bricking the six drops are bricking super hard. It's really a lot. You guys want to see? Are you guys are you guys done with this? You guys want to not see the set? We haven't even played Sapling, but when are we going to? You know, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how we didn't lose that game. That was so close. Okay, you know what? Let's do two more games with the Sapling, and then I'll switch that to something actually good. How about that? How about that?
it's not even sapling being bad it's just that there's too many six drops in the deck wait i think we're just gonna always keep this all right it's fine <coughs> yeah i know that guy comes completely through what the hell Uh, if you remove dragon, I'll donate another 500. <laughs> oh, it's tempting. Why? You don't like dragon? <laughs> ah, pass. I'm not going to play this just into rolling stone. There's no point. Someone's going to donate $500 if I remove Dragon from the deck. What do you guys say, guys? We're going to let the chat vote. Twitch chat vote. Do I, do I, what's it called? Do I sell out for the $500 to remove Dragon? I'm actually considering it. I don't think the person who made the offer, <laughs> I don't think Sandwich actually thought I would do it. All right, chat vote. Yes or no? You mean, well, remove or keep? Just write remove or keep in the chat. Don't don't vote more than once. Remove or keep. That's the name of the game. You can't run untrickable. Uh, counter hard counters my deck. Okay, this is fine. Sell out. Sell out for five five hundred bucks. That's a lot of money, guys. That's a lot of money. I'm poor. I don't know. The Canadian government took all my money via taxes. I'm, I'm very poor these days. I think I need the money. How are we going to win, though? I'm going to have to improvise some new win conditions. I'll probably just add Brianna. The chat's voting remove? <laughs> BTD says a thousand bucks. <laughs> this is the kind of chaos that goes on over here in the, in the live stream. Damn, this really screwed us up. We had a good play without that. We can go three and four. It's not bad. I think that's what I'm gonna do. We can also just go dragon. Oh, let's just dragon. Yeah, that's a strong play. Uh, the Gargologist is not the end of the world. Here. No, not 500 bits. I thought it was five hundred dollars. Was it five hundred bits? I'm not doing it for five hundred bits. No, sandwich spent five hundred bucks. Do it for the memes. <laughs> Do it to show how unbelievably manipulable I am. Wow, look at the great zucchini get it done here. This is mad. The madhouse. Look how good this is. Holy crap, that's a good great zucchini. <laughs> bye, Field. Bye, everyone. Have a nice day. Let's fry them up. Fry them up. Dragon and one is so simple. Good call, guys. Stop for I did. Damn, Dragon Great Zucchini seems like such a good combo, <laughs> for real. So what do we do now? What is he even- I don't even know what he's going for. He's probably not going for anything. We'll give him one of these. We'll swallow this too, for some reason. I don't know why. I feel like it, that's why. Yummy. We'll save the Cobb Cannon in case of emergency. Damn, we're dominating this game. They can't play tricks. They can't do anything. Did I miss lethal here? Kind of. Six and seven would have won, but what fun would that be? Oh, YouTube stream, the sound's off? Oh. You're right. There. Thank you. So now what? I think it's time to cop. It is time to cop hard. Hey, can we do it the fancy way? 
Guys, we're doing it the fancy way. I don't care. <laughs> Look at this play. This is called the fancy way of winning the game. Yes! <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Guys, we did it. We won the fancy way. All right, guys. I know this is selling out, but I, I gotta I gotta get the 500 bucks. I gotta get the 500 bucks, guys. What are we gonna use instead? I feel like this just adds extra creativity to this deck. What are we gonna use instead? We need win conditions. I think the Grace Zucchinis have been have been kicking it though. <clears throat> what else should I run though? We have too many sixes. All right, maybe this is the time I remove the saplings. Then we just run Brianna, and we run like. What other win condition is there? <laughs> five hundred rupees? No, not five hundred Canadian. Five hundred American. <laughs> <laughs> what else should I run? <laughs> what else should I run? <laughs> Fry sells out in 4K. I don't care. I don't care. Well, run Astrocado. It's way better. Maybe I'll like lighten up on the Brainanas a little bit and run like extra. Extra Cados. <clears throat> I think Astrocado has a lot of synergy with the stack, guys. Maybe I'll run. Maybe I'll run some more heals. We kind of need more heals, though. Should I just run uh, Allosaurus? Allosaurus is a good card. All right, run Allosaurus. It's beautiful. Shut up and take my money. Uh oh. Hello, Fry. Here are your five hundred bucks, and that's all I can fit in this message. What did it say? It doesn't appear on the screen. Wait, was that sandwich? Did they really do it? <laughs> did they really? Did, 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 did you really do it? No, it, it was only two bucks. I feel ripped off. I don't think that was really sandwich, though. <laughs> I think that was fake. You can put whatever you name name you want for donations. That's a pretty good hand. Alright, so what's our new deck list? Here's what our new deck looks like. <laughs> We're relying on the Great Jukini for the win condition. I mean, this deck's kind of dominating as is. I don't think it's a... Alright. <laughs> no, that was only $2. I know it didn't fit in the message. Didn't count. Oh, the deck disappeared. What is this guy's deal? Give me hammer. Or give me death. Should I go after this right now? I think I am. I can let her out. I think I'm going after it. Goodbye. That's okay. I think this deck's good enough to win with the Great Jukini. I think getting rid of the Saplings overall was an improvement, too. Um, do I do this now? Just I, I don't see a turn that we're going to... Well, we can do double on turn 6, actually, instead of the Renana. Does it really make a difference to prevent this little bit of damage coming in? Not really. It's just 4. It's just a flame face. You know what it is, guys. I'm still waiting. The sandwich is logging into her PayPal. I don't know, I don't know what's going on. Alright, we'll give him one of these. Laser base. I probably should have played around laser base, but killing the 2-4 is, is probably worth it anyway. Uh, it was deadly either way. I'm happy to kill the flame face here. In fact, we block. God damn it! Come on, man! Can't I block anything? Can't even block in Ohio. 
I'll save this for the for a better freeze. We got Brainanas. I think the Brainanas the Brainanas are just as good as Dragon. They'll just take over the game. Guys, behold the power of Brainana. What the hell is this? Five hundred bucks. Nope, that was two. That was two again. And that wasn't the real sandwich either. I don't agree. I'm not falling for it. Uh, so we got two plays here. One is like double ketchup. I think the ketchups are going to be better. I'm pretty sure developing this right now is the way. I think I'm going to let that two damage hit our face instead of dying to another deadly barrel. I'm just going to do it like this. <coughs> this is just more heals over time. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was you. I'm waiting. So I'm holding you to it, Sandwich. Holding you to it. Uh, what are we gonna do about this card? I guess we can brain Anna it eventually. Bro. Uh, so we probably just kill that. <coughs> Should we go phase for the six damage here? Or play more conservative? If I hit the both corns in lane one, we go phase for six. And then we proc the block. Uh... I, don't, I think I play conservative here. Yay! Just gotta keep these heals going. No, I don't chop. That's okay. In fact, that really just makes us heal way more with the catch-up mechanics. Probably happening this next turn here. <coughs> turn 7. So that that's possibly a good thing. We definitely don't go face for a six, so th this was the right play. So we got either Bog Brainana or Bog Double um, Ketchup. There's also a crazy world where it's Bog. This is a single Gravestone, so it's probably Brainana this turn. Um, I think we're going Bog. Brainana will finish this off. Turns out that little nerf of one. I mean, we have nine health instead of eight. That's fine. That's a zero. Great brain, Anna. Another one. On the way. So, is keeping a 4-3 alive worth it? This also heals when we hold it in hand. I think we're gonna hold it. There's gonna be some things. We don't have any removal left, so there's gonna be some things we really need to mog. Oh, third brain, Anna. Let's go. Ain't nothing wrong with that. I like the Allosaurus in the environment. He's just so hard to kill. And if he's going for Rocket, I'm just going to brain Anna him every single turn. <laughs> it's perfect. <coughs> I'm putting the dragons back in the deck after this game. I'm holding you to it, Sandwich. No more Mr. Nice Guy. I don't know. Uh, <coughs> to three, three, three. Good, good, good. Get bounced. They'll just bounce the Allosaurus. It's fine. The opponents are <laughs> just not doing enough damage. It's part of the deck is, like, you can out-heal them if you have all the bogs on the field. See ya. So, opponent does one this turn. Great. Wonderful. Uh, 
Na 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 Oh boy. So we have the mod for that. No brain end of this turn though. Uh yeah. <laughs> it's just Mog shrinking violet. It's so easy. And and, and dinosaur. This is perfect. Easiest play ever. Hopefully this goes down to to attack. There's only like three things that have more than two attack. Well, it's not one I know. So we completely negate this. Oh, should I do the heals now? This is a really good situation. Three four. <clears throat> I think I will actually. I'm gonna go for a three cost five five. Yeet. Hell yeah. And he still has the sad one one over here. Yes! This deck is actually the weird thing. We did this at the meme, but this deck is actually effective. Like the way of controlling with all the bogs and all the nerfs and the, even like the kernel pull into the. Sure, there, there's a lot happening here, man. This is more... I'm not going to say this is a, a anywhere close to a top-tier strategy, but it's legit. That's the point. We have actually Brainana Allosaurus. This turn is a really strong play for lethal. <coughs> With all the other trash we have on the field. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> and if he goes hard with the minions, we'll just frog. There's so many things we can do. It'll be like frog, frog, bog, uh, frog, Allosaurus. Frog, bog. Guys, look, it's called. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Get wrecked. <laughs> Pass turn 11. The man has got a guard feast or something up his sleeve. We're at 15 health. Don't ask how that happened. Yes. Easy. <laughs> We're four and one. He ain't surviving. He's turning. He ain't surviving. No, he already got Chatter. He got no. He does not even wait. Not even a way to survive. He gets super to lane four. That would be cool. Not gonna help. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I got rid of Dragon. Just put in Brainana. Same thing, really. I mean, not that much of a difference. Yes, yes. Brainana, the killer. Brainana is the plant food of the of the Smarty class. It just makes whatever you have on the field go face. Heck yeah. That is what I'm talking about. Probably are you a Zelda fan at all? I played like the Game Boy Zelda. That was my first Game Boy game actually. Wow, I forgot that. Some random person gave me a Game Boy for my bar mitzvah. Some super random person. Um, some rabbi. This most random person showed up on my bar mitzvah. But he was like, what do you want for your bar mitzvah? So I'm like, a Game Boy, obviously. So that's what he got. And he got me Zelda. Which is a pretty boring game as far as Game Boy games go, though, Go, but I appreciate it. That was the best present I got for my bar mitzvah. Like, that was the, that was the best present. I wonder what happened to that. I wonder if that Game Boy exists. That would be kind of cool to have. Uh, we're 4-in-1 now, right? We're not 5-in-1. <coughs> so this is a hand. I'm gonna not greedily keep this brain on. I think we got You guys like Game Boy? You guys like Game Boy Zelda? It was okay. It was kinda like a you know, puzzle platformer. It wasn't bad. I liked every time he takes a photo, he would be like all kawaii about it. What? <sighs> Are you a mage from Hearthstone? Because, hello! I don't get it. Is that one of the emotes? Well met! I'm a, I'm a paladin, obviously. I'm like, obviously a paladin. Shut up and take my money! I guess I have to explain the joke now. The first dono had 500 deer emojis, and the second dono had the words 500 bucks. But I forgot Jews aren't funny. Yeah, exactly. Joke. So you're not doing it? I feel I feel betrayed. Top 10 anime betrayals. Mm-mm. I'm not taking no for an answer sandwich. I'm putting the dragons back in the deck. Uh-oh. This this is very bad thing. I should have fronted this in case it was swashbuckler, right? Bro. Lame! 
Not doing it? Top 10 anime betrayals over here in the stream. I kind of like the deck better now anyway. <laughs> but just for the first for the principle of the thing. <clears throat> just for the principle. I think we're shrinking this turn and next turn. This thing's gonna go up to four attack. I don't feel like it. Garbage. Over the rainbow. No, this is going up to three though. Ugh. I don't know. I'm a little scared. La 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 la. We actually have, um, why does this have three attack though? Did he sugary treat that? What am I actually going to do here? Four, four, one, one. Do I goat this? I'm gonna goat this just for. Just for staying alive. I'm gonna hit him with this. This is not gonna do damage anyway. It could be a flame phase, but it'll get blocked. It's okay. Yeah, flame phase doesn't do it. It just dies to shrinking next turn. The zero here. He sugaries this one. Does that live now? It's so annoying. I think the cop eats it though. This. This has got to be worth it, right? We're so low health. Ugh. This is three to face. Better than five. I like my health. I enjoy my face. Uh, if he plays a pirate in one or four, that th this actually answers it, which is cool. A player in environments. It plays around a few things. It's not a whole eat it could double sugary tree. This is oh, so annoying. That's basically the same thing. So he's going phase for seven. Ugh. Block infinity clone. So he's down to zero cards. That's the good news. We gotta just survive here. He's gonna put it here. Oh, it's so annoying. So, I think we proc the block and do this in a different lane. Pretty sure it's like this. We really have to win here, right? He can block and get infinity clones. But it's a 1 in 3 getting infinity clones and we'd have to land exactly in lane 3. Actually, well, we have a full block meter too. Yeah, this is fine. Infinity Clones doesn't even necessarily win in the game. He'd have to get them in lane 3 and 5 exactly in order to get pin or roll a 1. It's so unlikely. No, not line dancing! Well, we still usually win. Could you not roll a 1 here, please? Oh! Oh, 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 oh. oh my god, he got Infinity Clones on the block as well. Do not get lane 5, okay? So the overshoot should get blocked here. And now we have a superpower, so we mog so it doesn't have strike through. Gosh. What am I supposed to do around here? Okay, good. Sheesh. Okay. So it's going to be shrinking violet now. <laughs> I mean, top deck madness. Talk about it, right? So we, we shrinking here. I don't know. He's, he's probably going to play into the environment. So shrinking, as long as it's not a gravestone, the shrinking, shrinking will take it out. Yes. Yes! Yes! We should win. I mean, he can he can, he can roll a 1, 4, and block. We could have 1 health. Probably will have 1 health at the end of the day. There's no more clones. So we'll double this up in case of, a, I don't know, we need a team up next turn. Can we, can we win? Oh, God. <laughs> How is this guy still... Now he has two cards. That's really good burning the deadly there. Don't need deadly. He needs 1 damage. We also have one damage in lane one, which is really huge here, because it means he needs a gravestone to not die in lane one. Could you not do a gravestone here, please? Yeah, that didn't do anything. 
gosh, it's so tense. <laughs> what am I gonna do? I mean, line dancing zombie just straight up wins the game. You know how it is, guys. There's nothing I can do about it, too. Yes! Yes, victory is ours! Yes! Yes! I think we're 5 and 1 now, right? Oh my gosh, what a match, though! What a match! Highlight match? <clears throat> YouTube? YouTube? YouTube. It's YouTube time. YouTube time for sure. <sighs> Alright, guys. Dragon's going back in the deck. I think we'll just do it like that. It's pretty good. <laughs> do you guys really like the great zucchinis? <laughs> uh, the allosauruses are better, though, right? They're way better. It's like so much better. Here, let's get rid of some of the sixes from this deck and actually add a third allosaur. So it should probably be a fourth one, too. <laughs> Alright, that's pretty good. <sighs> Top 10 anime betrayals happening in the stream. The Shy Guy King? I feel like I know this guy. I think this is an OG PVZ Heroes player. Used to be in like a hangout in the comment section. Uh... Question is, should I freeze here? I think we freeze next turn, because next turn he does 4 damage. This is going to be one of these Brainstorm uh, OTK Science decks. I can smell it. <clears throat> This would be a good turn to, to freeze against the four damage um, environment. Maybe we'll we'll pull off the bog here too. That'd be nice. It's nice to have some heals in this matchup. <clears throat> this is also not a bad card. We don't know. We just saw <laughs> brainstorm using neutron. And we're like, oh, it's my deck. Not necessarily. So that's good for us. Um, I'm gonna let that part happen and make a make a, a good trade here because this again being off the board This can have a lot of potential if he starts playing the, the meteors these <laughs> I take this deck so seriously. I love the science brainstorm deck I played probably a hundred game, you know, I played 10 on stream, but I have probably played at least 90 off stream I was really grinding this deck for a while, perfecting it, and then kind of just playing it for fun after. This is a really strong play, because he's going for Sugary Tree bonus attack, and he's not. He is rolling a zero there. Yes! In fact, this deck, with all the hammers and all the shrinking violets and the bogs and the healing, is such a hard counter if this is the, the Brainstorm deck. The infamous Science Brainstorm. The name of the video was Everyone's Gonna Play Science after seeing this deck, and this is actually second stream where we've had an opponent potentially playing it looks like it. I mean, we run the, uh... Ooh, Donut on 5! Let's see if he's running, you know, if he's running Helicopter, which was the original version of the deck at Helicopter. Oh, we got the... <laughs> we have three answers! Oh my gosh, please pass! Please pass! Come on, you need Helicopter, we have 18 health, you need Helicopter, right? Right? Uh, right. <laughs> I don't know. This is a pretty good brain, Anna. Not bad. Yes. Take it off. This first one probably should have gone here. He's going to be scared of the brain, Anna, though. I can actually just protect it. Yeah, you guys know how this works. <laughs> More brain, Anna! <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're gonna uh, dragon next turn, so I'll just protect this. The obvious play is this famo minion here. It also adds extra damage, kind of for free, no extra block meter charge. You know how it is. Go for it again. 
Yeah, one more time. One more time. <laughs> See a brainstorm. Oh my god. I mean, honestly, this deck is the nightmare. We're running Brainana Dragon, Heals, Hammer, Shrinky. I mean, this is a this this deck is the best matchup for the science. Come on, man. Come on, man. Alright, six and one. The answer is yes. We'll play one more. For science. Yes! Oh <laughs> Brainana is such a good card. I don't care. I don't care. The answer is yes. Correct. Yeah, I'll pay out the bets. The answer. Well, wow, only 44% voted yes for this deck. They didn't believe. This is legit. This is actually performing so much better. So much better than I thought. Oh, here we'll have a classic. This is gonna be classic, guys. The answer is yes. The answer is get wrecked. That's what the answer is. Woo! Oh, I didn't update the deck. <coughs> did I take a screenshot? Yeah, I did. It's like, oh, I forgot to update the deck. I literally, literally forgot. I like that we can just play this slow and hit him with the ball. We're holding like an extra bog in our hands all the time. I love it. Absolutely love this. Um, this should be fine. Honestly, like, Twin Sunflower dies to so many things. Everything from Beam Me Up and Shrinking Violet. I played into Alien News is the one card I played into. But this, again, summoning usually does not have three attack. It could go, like, two for one. No, he missed it. This probably should have gone on the ground. It plays less against, what, Acid Rain? Who cares? I should be playing around Alien News there. La, 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 la. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's pretty Nana. I mean, it's only four. I could do this play. Nah, that's so strong. <laughs> I'll go for the Rain Nana. Yes. It's like dominated, man. Dominated. Good, solid control. Everything you want out of a deck. He's going to be so afraid of the second Brain Nana that now the catcher mechanics become a little better. <clears throat> it's just a teleportation zombie. We know what it is. Uh, I should play around Alien Ooze, though, still, right? So I'm just going to do this. Ping his block meter meaninglessly. <laughs> this means that Weed Whack kills this next turn. He's not really. Uh, what is he gonna teleport in? What is man even gonna teleport in? It, it 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 blocks it blocks the teleport from killing our ramp, so he would need a removal card. You know, he's a removal card. <laughs> That's fine. We got bog. We got whatever we want. I'm probably not gonna dragon teleportation zombie again. Dragon doesn't do anything to slow it down. Only turn six. <laughs> Oh, we got plays. We can actually just like dry. Oh, there's so many things we can do here. We can bog and then dry cop cannon. I don't know why I would do that though. I should probably replace this. It's just hurting us, right? So we cob like this. I'll I'll just cover this. Why not? Was there... No, Dragon never kills. So now there's three threats on the field. Bro is packing teleport. Yes! Easy! Matt, this deck actually really... I know I keep saying it, but really, really performed well. Could not be happier with the way... Bog, man. You know, the, the Discord guys used to like running a lot of Bog. I don't think it was quite like this with all the... Hammers and sh toads and stuff, but it did well. It really, you know, even like opponents that were spamming and teleporting in mini ninjas and pirates, it just slowed them down enough that we could win. I, I think there's something here. I, I, I actually want to try a legit, like, try hard, you know, serious version of this deck. I mean, we got rid of the sap fling. I'd probably get rid of like the frog too, and you know, stable out the curve, give you a little bit more fives. Maybe at that point, run Twin Sunflower. Maybe a little extra one or twos. 
probably needs a little extra early game. It seems like to play on curve, you know, you're playing six plus one. Like, having a little more early game would be good. This deck was legit, though, man. Legit deck. Love it. And now that we have the Brain Annas, you don't die as hard to tell if I probably run four Brain Annas in this deck. This is very, very cool, though. I mean, extremely. I'd get rid of the frog and add more early game. Or more fives or something. Maybe another aloe and then two more early game cards. There's a lot of options. I mean, Rose. <laughs> PBZ tryhards here. He's like, I heard tryhard. I meant, I meant the serious version. Tryhard, if you have a version of this deck, though, happy to hear it. Anyway, guys, that was Lower Your Plants. <laughs> Got 101 stars up in here. Wow, this is a new season. It's supposed to reset, so that should happen soon. I will see you guys in the next video. Hope you enjoyed. It certainly did. That is most certainly going on YouTube. Peace. This is Fry. Yes, what a stream.